Hey y'all, this is Seven Woods here. Welcome to another ranking video. Last week, or last ranking video, I did a sub chain logo ranking video where I ranked all the different uh, sub shop, fast food sub shops based off their logo. Go check it out if you haven't seen it. But in this video, I am doing pizza chain logos. Pizza is a big deal here in America. Um, big deal with me and my family. And uh, we all have our favorites and we all you know we all love their logos or hate them so we are going to be ranking 14 different of these logos from my least favorite to my favorite so without further ado let's start with number 14 my least favorite pizza chain logo and right now we have cc's it's because they've had a new logo the past couple years and i think it is gosh awful compared to the other one the other one which i'll put side by side is just amazing it's um it's warming it's welcoming it's rustic and then they changed it to this super modern attempt at it and i just i don't like how the pizza slices are different colors and different sizes and cc's is just a lot more boring font um and beyond pizza i don't know i feel like they're definitely stepping away from their roots and going to a modern a modern look that just doesn't make sense for them and just doesn't look good i hate it um it's my least favorite pizza logo change um currently well we'll be talking to one talking about a different one later on but yeah i absolutely hate it don't like it i don't think it represents pizza well and it's not as welcoming as their old logo moving on to number 13 we have round table this is another uh company that changed their logo um, and I'll put side by side. I like the other logo. Um, maybe not better, but I think it's a little bit more welcoming as a pizza shop. Uh, this one is uh, black and white. Really cool font. And I like the color scheme of black and white. And the pizza royalty is a nice touch. I like that little slogan. But it just doesn't feel like pizza. When I think of pizza, I don't think of a black and white logo that really looks like that there's nothing about it except the pizza word reminds me of pizza and that's a big part about logos is representing what you are serving what you are making and i don't think round table uh has that with its new uh logo i don't think the other one really did either but it's a little bit more vibrant and welcoming than this one so that's why this is ranked so low moving on to number 12 we have stevie b's pizza buffet um Another one that has a fairly new logo. Um, I will do the side by side once again. This one, uh, this change isn't terrible. It's a very simple uh, lime green kind of white uh, color scheme. Uh, simple, but I don't know. It's just kind of kind of ugly. I think it's kind of ugly. Um, it would probably worse be worse than Round Table if. Um, if round table just wasn't so non pizza like in my opinion um but this one is probably to a lot of people arguably worse it's just kind of ugly um nothing too sleek comforting anything about it color scheme isn't great um just don't like it don't have a super solid reason i just think it's ugly um moving on to number 11 we have was it S sparrow sparrow i don't know i've never had this pizza before um, but another one that has changed their logo in the past uh, several years, I will do the comparison. These pizza chains are just updating logos like crazy. Um, I do not like the new logo as much. Um, they went for a more modern look, more sleek modern look, kind of like CC's. And once again, I just don't like it as much. I like the, um, the, the title of the company behind the uh, Italian flag um this one's not terrible i like how it is shaped like a pizza it got some bonus points for that and i like how the nyc 1956 is where the crust would be but overall i just i think these pizza chains are going too modern and ignoring what makes pizza so great it's just a comforting welcoming taste feel look so um that's why it is ranked so low Going to number 10, breaching the top 10, we have Godfather's Pizza. This is one that has a fairly um, uh, 
standard logo that hasn't changed in quite a while. I don't think it's that bad. Um, I just now noticed making this video that it's not like a triangle pizza slice. It is a hand holding a pizza pie and it's not bad. I like the little aroma scent in yellow coming off of the pizza pie. The Godfather's Pizza in red matches everything decently. Um, there's some other variations of the logo, but this is the one that I found the most common. I actually drove by one in Alabama uh, not too long ago, and this was the logo they had on their uh, storefront. Um, nothing too bad about it. Um, I don't think it's great, but you know, the color scheme's okay, and it's layered out okay, and um, just nothing I love about it, but nothing I hate about it. I think it's a, a decent, a decent logo. Uh, moving on to number nine, we have Jets Pizza. Um, the reason why this is ranked so low is because Jet himself, or whoever the mascot is, I think he looks a little creepy, a little sadistic, uh, with that big wide smile and them beady eyes, but I love the color scheme, the, the red, white, and green representing Italy. Um, I like how in all the Jets logos, it fades just like the flag to the green, white, red. And I like how Jet is representing the same color scheme. And then Pizza's in black, and then same with his Jet Pack, that's in black. I just, the overall color scheme is phenomenal on this logo, in my opinion. They do it very well. Some of their other logos have um, a city behind it. I don't know if it's representing New York or Chicago. Um, Y'all could tell me. But I, I like this logo. It'd be ranked a lot higher if um, the mascot himself wasn't so damn creepy. So moving on to number eight, I believe. We have Hungry Howie's. Hungry Howie's. Um, I love the color scheme. I love the yellow and red and white. Uh, I think it goes pretty well. And then the, the black perimeter as well around the writing and then Howie himself. Um, decent logo. Um, I think it's, uh, it could be better if it didn't look kind of childish in my opinion, but I mean, a lot of pizza places like to attract the younger, the, the kids and whatnot. So it's not bad. Uh, good color scheme. Um, there's nothing really besides the word pizza again, that represents pizza. And that's another reason why I didn't do, um, as well, but I like it. Um, I think it's fun. I think it's welcoming and I like the color scheme a lot. Um, going on to number seven, we have California Pizza Kitchen. Um, this logo, very sleek, whether they have the California Pizza Kitchen in it or not. Um, just very simple, modern in the right way. I like how you do it. Uh, the, you got the yellow diamond and then the black palm tree. Simple, sleek, elegant, still welcoming. Palm trees are welcoming, make you feel good. Um, represents California fantastically, like the color scheme, the black and yellow, and then you know, usually they have a white um, background uh, when they have the California Pizza Kitchen in the logo as well. Um, I like it very much. Um, pretty sleek and not bad at all. Uh, going on to number six, we have Marco's. Marco's is a very welcoming uh, pizza chain. It has like nearly a full pizza on its logo. I love that. I love implementing the pizza in the pizza logos. And then you got the red, white, yellow uh, scheme and then uh, Pizza is usually written in black on the bottom, like you see there. Uh, I like the color scheme. Um, I, I like the message. I like how it looks. Very welcoming, very pizza-esque. Um, it's just a little clunky. The, the the bread M that encompasses everything, a little blocky, a little, um, I don't know, a little big, a little clunky. Um, and that's, that's why I docked it points. But overall, I really like it. Um, I don't think... Uh, it's too simple or too um, uh, too much going on. I, I like it. Uh, so moving on to the top five, the top five best pizza chain logos. Um, we have Pizza Hut at number five. And this would be probably top three if they didn't change their damn logo. Uh, as you'll see, I'll pull up the other Pizza Hut logo. I really like it. Even the ones further, further back, I like. I think they've just gotten uh, almost worse and worse. Uh, the old logo was just so nice. I, I like the black and the red, white background. It, it, it's just the Pizza Hut I'm used to. It's the one I grew up with. Uh, but this new one, I mean, it's not terrible. That's why it's still top five. Um, you still got the decent design um, or the basic design element with the 
the hut up top and then Pizza Hut. And I kind of get what they're doing. It's kind of like a modern twist, but they still made it almost like when you put the tomato sauce on the pizza itself. That's kind of what the logo looks like. Not bad, it's, it's not terrible. That's why, again, it's at number five, but I like their old logo better. Whoa, I like their old logo better, and that's why it's not top three, but still decent. Um, the red and white is there. I wish they had some black like they used to, but oh well. Uh, moving on to number four, we have Mellow Mushroom. I really like the Mellow Mushroom logo. Um, there's a couple different variants um, out there um, with different color schemes, but this is the, the newest one and the one I've seen most common on merchandise lately. Um, you got Mellow Mushroom. Uh, Mellow and Mushroom are in two different fonts, but I kind of like it because Mellow has that sort of m the mellow, swoopy, cursive-esque uh, font, and then Mushroom is uh, kind of this funky, um, bolder uh, font. And I, I like it, it goes well together. And then you have uh, Mellow Mushroom himself. He's just vibing with that pizza slice. Again, I love it when logos implement what they represent in their logos, uh, or companies represent, you know what I was trying to say. Um, but I like it all together. I think it just, it looks mellow. I think it represents the name well, the company brand, and it has pizza in it. And I, I just like it. I think it's a good logo. And that's why it's number four beating out Pizza Hut but not if they have their own logo. Um, number three is a controversial one. It is Papa John's. Uh, I heard that last year they changed their new logo to this, um, and that's awful. I don't know why they do it. That just gets rid of everything that made the logo before. It's terrible, um, but I have, actually, I don't know if I have faith in Papa John's anymore. They've made some critical decisions late, as of late, but I'm hoping they revert back to the original looking logo. They've they've changed it before and then changed it back, realized it's a bad idea. I hope they do the same this time. Um, for the reason why they're changing it is why it's probably not higher. Um, I just, I'm kind of in limbo, but I'm representing the old logo right now. Um, I really like the old logo. My dad worked for Papa John's for a long, 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 long time, uh, along with family friends, other family members. So Papa John's is very nostalgic for me, very close to my heart. So it's hard not to have in the top three, but I really like it. I like the uh, black, not black, whoa, what am I saying? Red, white, and green color scheme, the green perimeter around Papa John's, the pizza up top. Um, it's one of the more most iconic pizza chain logos out there. Um, so I don't know why they change it. That's stupid. It's I like the old logo. That's what I'm doing right now. It's just, it's nice, um, welcoming, has the pizza on there. May not an actual pizza, but the pizza is more, you know, out there. I don't know. It's what I grew up with, so it's hard not to be a little bit biased on this logo. But coming up at number two, second best pizza logo, we have Domino's. A very iconic uh, logo. Hasn't changed much at all. Um, it's just a wonderful logo, the red, white, and blue color scheme. Again, it reminds me of America. I, I'm really into um, red, white, and blue color schemes. The domino itself, very nice. Got the two and the one, and uh, it's just, I mean, the, the domino's font itself is just simple, not bad at all. It's hard not to like this logo. It's pretty iconic too. One of the most iconic ones right up there with Pizza Hut, Papa John's. And they haven't really changed it much. And when they have, it's been slight details that don't change the basics. And that's why um, they're so high. And it's just a nice, nice logo. Great color scheme, simple. Um, domino, it has a domino, it represents the company name. Um, but number one, the best pizza chain logo out there is Little Caesars. I love this logo. Uh, the black, orange, and white color scheme just goes so well together for some reason. And Little Caesar himself, always with the the um, spear and the pizza, and he's eating a slice. Just it's phenomenal. It's welcoming. It's iconic. Um, it's a good design. Good good color scheme, and it's just so good. So good. Like wonderful best best pizza logo out there um just it has the pizza in it. it has a good font good color scheme 
welcoming, warming, everything you would want in a pizza logo. So that's why, Little Caesars, you have the best pizza logo in my opinion. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I um, Let me know what y'all think. Um, what's y'all's favorite pizza logos? Which ones uh, do y'all hate? Which changes are y'all good with? Which changes of logos make y'all upset like me? Like CC's and Pizza Hut and Papa John's if they actually follow through with this the next few years? Terrible decision. Um, let me know. I hope y'all liked it. If you did, hit that like button. And if y'all are new, want to see more of these type of videos, subscribe and stick around. Anyways, Southern Woods out.